Good everyone, hey Chris Fahey here, hope you're going awesome. So back on Vlogmas today, it's the weekend and we've had a couple of requests come through to check out Drury. So I'm jumping in the car, going to cruise out and um, check that out today. Alright team, so we just arrived out in Drury. Now I'm not going to lie, it's a bit of a pain getting a good vantage point on um, exactly what's going on. But this is, I guess, the edge of some of the town centre development. Um, as you can see, they're sort of kicking into the major earthworks at the moment. And um, definitely a little bit of a pain to get a good angle without getting like a helicopter or a drone up. Um, but yeah, we might cruise around and see if we can find a slightly better angle. Alright team, so slightly better vantage point, right? So this is just the edge of some of the major earthworks. And so a um, little bit of background on this, right? So this is the um, sort of Drury, I think it's town centre slash Drury East um, development area. And so there's three major landowners, Kiwi Property, Oyster Capital and Fulton Hogan, who have pushed through the plan change. Um, if you've been following it, it got held up for a little while. Um, it looks like they're now into earthworks phase on this, so it'll be a little bit of time before they properly kick off, but this will be a pretty comprehensive development. Uh, major town centre, housing, commercial, retail, all sorts of stuff, so it um, should be pretty exciting once it gets underway and will make a pretty big dent in terms of providing some um, good housing supply for the Auckland region. Um, so look, with that said, we'll cruise around, see if we can find some other vantage points, and um, also check out the Drury industrial area while we're down here. Now, just being real honest, I'm not super familiar with all the intricacies of this at the moment, but I'm um, driving around, spotted one of the other land holdings. So um, Oyster Capital has got some of their, I guess, um, flexi hoarding up on one of the pieces of land. And um, as you cruise around, you can see that they're also um, doing some earthworks at the moment as well, maybe just in the early phases. Um, so, yeah, definitely quite a bit of activity, um, but it's quite hard to spot from the road just due to the contour and the terrain around here. So yeah. So our second and probably final stop today is the Drury South um, industrial area. And so you can see that they've obviously got earthworks underway at the moment, um, but they've also got a bunch of the vertical construction coming as well. And this is one of the areas that you can see from the motorway just kind of running alongside it. Um, so pretty cool to see some progress down here. Now I believe a lot of the land for this was associated with the old quarry site. Um, which you can just sort of see over there um, but obviously to get it ready for um, the vertical industrial construction they've had to do a whole lot and I assume these um, like wetlands and that type of stuff's all new as well. Finally for today's vlog I wanted to check out this building here which is the Cardinal Logistics Facility uh, down in Drury South Crossing. Now a couple of things that make this one interesting is apparently the building's got a very high level of automation in it um, which makes sense as the cost for things like warehousing, staff, that type of stuff increases that we'll see more firms looking to automation. The other thing you'll notice is that it's got a huge breezeway, um, so covered area down the side of the warehouse itself. And this is something that we're seeing more of as um, logistics operators want a really nice covered area to do loading and unloading. Um, so that's becoming a much bigger feature of some of these big box um, distribution warehouses. So like with that said, um, we're actually going to use this project to tick off um, the industrial project of our 12 days of Vlogmas themes. Um, hopefully that's not too cheeky. And yeah, we'll wrap this up here and we'll see you tomorrow.